1995 was a pivotal year in the life of technology executive Tom Alberg. After reviewing a business plan from a young entrepreneur who had just arrived in Seattle, Alberg decided to invest in Jeff Bezos' nascent online bookstore. Yeah, I think he's somebody who sees the future. And, uh, you know, when you think about his decision to invest in Amazon, that was in 1995, okay? And uh, the graphical web browser only came along in 1993, all right? So the web was nothing at that point. Tom was able to recognize that Jeff had seen the future. But Alberg didn't stop there. Sensing the untapped potential of internet technology, he and a group of friends formed a new Pacific Northwest investment firm. When I look back upon it, I, I don't know why we were willing to take this risk. Somehow we were thinking, well, we'd make these investments and five years later, they might be worth something. 25 years later, those bets are worth something and then some. Madrona Venture Group, as a firm is now known, is a powerhouse of Northwest venture capital marking its 25th anniversary this year. Amazon is one of the most valuable companies in the world. And Alberg, who turned 80 this year, has built an enduring legacy as an industry and community leader whose ambitions for his hometown of Seattle and the Northwest extend well beyond technology, shaping the broader region. So everybody I think around the table, if I was to ask them what, what Tom's biggest contribution is, is a guy that can't fail to see the future. He's not a guy that's entrenched in today and what do I do tomorrow figuratively. He's a man who sees only the vision and doesn't let people say no to a vision and believes that if you empower them by making them think about a vision of the future, there's probably not a whole lot we can't accomplish. Tom is a, an amazing mix of being humble, and being driven, um, which is very hard to do, and uh, but yet that's just the essence of who he is, so it's just natural. Um, and it, it produces amazing results, um, not just in, in the companies that he invests in, but also in the communities that he's a part of, uh, in, in the relationships he's a part of, because it helps bring out the very best in, in who you are. By far, Tom's biggest contribution to Seattle has been this uh, creation of a, an ecosystem around entrepreneurs, founders, and the ability to get funded and build companies. Entrepreneurs who work with Alberg talk about his loyalty and patience. We founded the company in the year 2000. Think how many venture capitalists would stick with a company for 20 years. It took us 16 years to get to IPO. The fact that we had Tom on our board and that steady hand, that calm confidence and the understanding that we will eventually get there and that there's, there's this gigantic opportunity in front of us actually allowed us to grow the company and build it to where we are today with incredible promise for the future. And Tom has been with us from day one. He's been with us for 20 years. But above all else, people in Tom Alberg's life marvel at his ability to see the future. Almost everything he does is about what is going to be. You know, whether it's um, planting a tree that won't be mature for 80 years, oh, driverless cars, which he's so excited about. You know, he just believes in what hasn't happened yet. You know, believing in the future is a very optimistic uh, state of mind. 